What are you doing, big guy? Get up there. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, everyone. Hi. Happy New Year. Can you say What's that you say? You didn't know that I come sugar-free also? But I'm still just as sweet. <laughs> Because when I get excited, my voice just goes up and like, I'm loud. Like it's, I don't mean to be obnoxious or anything, but like, I'm just loud. My voice will be like, I'm a, I don't know, whatever. What's a man like you doing all day? Oh. Then I need to start sharing the, the hard stuff too, because I never want to bring you guys down, but I think that maybe by me sharing some of the hard stuff that I go through, Maybe you guys can relate and like, I'm tired of hiding it. I feel like I'm hiding it, like I'm ashamed of my struggles. And I shouldn't be, you know, I shouldn't be ashamed of my struggles. Okay, let me get out of the way. Let me get out of the way, you little robot. Hold on. Oops, wait, 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 wait. Is that? This is a, there's Marshall. <laughs> this is a picture or the, a video of what I'm eating. It's Sunday and it's lunchtime. So um, I did have a salad this morning too. I had a big Caesar salad with no chicken. But um, this one does have chicken and it's got like all different kind of vegetables in it too. So it's super yummy. Um, I'm just trying to stay like satisfied because I've noticed that when I'm not when I'm really hungry I just want to get anything like it doesn't even matter um and that's where I need to like make sure that I'm staying I let it go too far before I ate I should have had a snack and I didn't so I'll do better later it's just been really rough with um let's see if I can bring this back up it's been really rough I think I've had like postpartum depression not not as uh severe as I did the first time but the only difference was is that um like it's just there's more demands on me now like I have a husband and two kids and there's somebody who always needs me to do something and I, and I love that I do I just think that finding time for myself has been really hard and there's been like a lot of days of like mental anguish and I I know that I have everything in the world to be grateful and thankful for but I do not feel grateful and I don't feel thankful and um, I feel angry and moody and just um, I'm not even upset with myself that I'm being angry and moody like I, I don't know just a lot of different what's on my lips How about you what is it say hi 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 oh what are you doing mm -hmm. feel like re-inspired to vlog again and um I'm not diving I'm not going to food pantries right now um but I'm still doing cool stuff I'm more wanting to show you guys, I've had, throughout my entire life, ever since I was younger, had serious problems with food issues, um, and I am recovering from those. I've never been properly diagnosed, but it This bread is super yummy. It's 70 calories. It's got fiber, protein, omega-3, whole grains. And for one slice of 70 calories, which actually isn't bad, especially 
so that I can put some sugar-free strawberry jam on it. And that's only 10 calories per tablespoon. So really nice, yummy snack. It's late at night. It's like, I'm trying to get stuff done so I can go to bed and I'm hungry. So this is gonna be an awesome little snack. It's gonna be sweet and it'll hold me over until the morning. I didn't know for a long time that I did, but then I became aware that, okay. I guess I always knew something was wrong, but I didn't know what it was and I didn't have any information about certain things so I didn't really know but um, I've you know just had a lot of issues with um, eating disorders and then like binge exercising and binge eating and like just restricting restricting um, just craziness maybe food addiction I, I don't know I'm not really sure I want to call it that so I have this Greek non-fat yogurt with vanilla and That's what it looks like. There's a lot of protein in there. 15 grams, I like that. It's like in it, so I'm gonna put like the smallest little bit. Are you making my cookies? Yeah. Let's see what that tastes like. How many pieces that is. That's, that's enough. So it's gonna be my little, my little snack. I'll show you, it's not a huge little bowl. It's, it's gonna be yummy though. It'll satisfy me. Check out this really cool wall tapestry that I got for a dollar in an Amazon liquidation store. Isn't that awesome? I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna sit down and eat this and we'll chat a little bit more. Make sure to check out my family's um, new YouTube channel called it's actually called duck tail farms so check that out I was incorrect about that but I put the logo out so that you could notice that the page was you playing my little stream you playing my little stream duck tail farms you're gonna love it they're cute they're adorable um, there's two, it's a husband and wife, my niece and nephew, and they're two little girls, my uh, great nieces. So, and they are getting chickens, ducks, all kind of awesome stuff, and they're going to share their journey, and I think that's awesome. So, every time they post a video, I check it out. So, I'll make sure to leave that channel's link in the description. Just, if you would show them support, I, I absolutely love that. Um, and I'm trying to get my brother to come back on <laughs> at some point, but I don't know. You know, he's just kind of taking a break, and he's got... He's doing really well right now, so I'm just really thankful for that. And um, so, yeah, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and um, I hope you enjoy the content to come. It's a new year. It's a fresh, clean slate. That's something that I really appreciate about Jesus is that we're forgiven, and so we are going to make mistakes all the time, but we uh, can have a clean slate and ask for forgiveness, and we're always forgiven. And I think we're always just trying to do the best we can anyway. So I love you. Jesus loves you. And I'll see you in the next video.